Hello and welcome back to more Let's Play Jack and Daxter the Precursor Legacy. I am the Max of Few Trades. In the last part, we went to the Misty Island and got all the power cells, and then we got on a floating motorbike and crossed an active volcano and somehow didn't die in the process. And in this part, we've made it to the elusive. Hey, don't forget about the sage and me! You have to turn on the teleport gate to let us through! It's in the Blue Sage's lab by the end of Fire Canyon. If you don't let us through, then we can't help you! Alright, well, I was gonna say that, but Kira took, or took care of it for me, so, uh, awesome! For once, I don't mind being interrupted by the characters. And, whoop! Whoa! I don't think I'll ever get used to that teleporter tingling sensation. Hey! It looks like the Blue Sage threw a party! Oh my! Rock Village is on fire! One heck of a party! No, no! I mean, Rock Village is being bombarded with flaming boulders! Oh! And it looks like the Blue Sage is working on a levitation machine to move them! Assuming it's operational, we're gonna need power cells to fuel it! I guess you two are going to have to find some ore! We'd better take a look at his notes. Jack, go check on the villagers, then come back and give us an update. And take the furball with you. Can do, Mr. Sage Pants. So there we go. We've got an update on the progress of the, of the story and the like, and now we, we've we got some stuff to do. It's time to say hello to the villagers and see what's what. As I jump down here, and I try to escape before the lurker shark comes and eats me, and I didn't do it in time. Yeah. Funny thing, that. Okay, then. I guess I'm not going to be going down that way. Whatever. It's not, it's not the way you're supposed to go anyway, so... There we go. Alright. Yes, it appears some no no good. Until we find out why the blue sage disappeared, you're going to need to collect 45 power cells to fuel his machine. Go get him. Okay, the first time I didn't mind being interrupted, but now that's starting to get annoying again. I don't even remember what I was gonna say. Either way, some no good nefarious no nerd duel has been chucking giant flaming boulders at a helpless village. So, naturally, we're probably gonna have to go and do something about that. Very old. What's your deal? You two look like a couple of capable fellows. I've got a research project going, and maybe you could help me out. Hey, we're the ones on a big quest here. We ask you for help. Well, perhaps we can help each other. I've been studying the burrowing habits of lightning moles in the Precursor Basin next to our village for years. But now those awful lurkers have scared the moles to the surface. And since they're blind as bats, they can't find their way back underground. If you could herd them back into their burrowing tunnels, you might just save their lives. I've got a power cell that says you can do it. Yeah, lightning moles. We can. Maybe for two power cells. Nice try. But I would be willing to part with another power cell if you two find me 90 precursor orbs for my research equipment. Fair enough? All right, a new mission. We must go shave the mole. I said shave. No, we must save the moles. Save the lightning moles. You know what? No, I'm going to go over there and I'm going to shave the lightning moles. Because why the hell not? Okay, that's actually really sweet. All right, and I do believe there are more people over here of which to speak to. Yep, there's a sobbing guy. Why so sobby, sobby? Oh, my aching head. I thought that's one of your vital organs. Walk it off, tough guy! Oh, sure, I was tough once. Maybe even the toughest of them all. I single-handedly defended this village from those horrid creatures for almost a year. Then that horrible monster arrived and commenced the boulder bombardment. So, full of valor, armor shining in the sun, I climbed the hill to take him on! But he pounded me like one tenderizes a yakow steak. Have you tried attacking him with your melodrama? Cause it's killing me! After my last stunning failure, he sealed the passageway to his roost with a 30-ton boulder, leaving no way for anyone to challenge him again. So, our sage, a master of blue eco, and a mechanical genius devised a machine capable of lifting the boulder out of the way. But alas, he disappeared before we had a chance to turn it on. 
And he took all his power cells with him. At least I was able to pull enough pontoons out of our bridge to prevent that monster from coming down here to do me harm. Yeah, uh, good, good job, tough guy. But uh, we're, we're gonna need you to uh, put him back and stuff. Oh, sure. And seal my doom? <sighs> All right. Fine. Bring me 90 precursor orbs and I'll let the pontoons loose. But I'm not going to fight that monster again. Yeesh. Seriously, dude, pull yourself together. That's just downright pathetic. Oh no, not another hero. I lost my shorts on this so-called hero's bit fight against the monster up there. But trust me, the smart money's on the monster. That way you pretty much tapped me out. So, I got a proposal. Bring me 90 orbs to get me back on my feet and out of this barrel, and I'll give you a power cell in return. And if you're game, I do have one more bet online. My big comeback. Beat the record time racing Dead Man's Gorge in the Precursor Basin, and I'll get a pretty payoff. For that, I'll give you another power cell. All right, then. We have our mission set. Pretty much, there should be... Yep, and there's only two things left, and that's another oracle. You know, that giant stone Olmec head that if we th throw 120 orbs into, it'll give us a power cell. If those are the, la or the last two are, so now we know the location of all of the power cells of Rock Village. Which is nice, fine, and dandy, but there's not really much we can do here without a whole lot more orbs. We've only got 76, so that's not even enough to get one. Interesting. So let us venture off into an area, the Precursor Basin. Oh, this is going to be a very long and painful experience, I can assure you of that. At least we get our zoomer. Alright, let's go. The thing is, we do this entire area on this thing. And this is one of those lightning bolt daily butter guys. Just gotta spook him into one of their, uh, one of their hidey holes, as it were. Like so! Get in the holes! Get in the holes, Mr. Mole! And that's another thing completely unrelated. We'll deal with that later. Right now I'm dealing with the lightning moles. Get in... I'm herding squirrels! These do not look like moles, they look like squirrels. Seriously, get in the hidey hole, now! Ah, okay, that's a step in the right direction, but not quite enough. No, nope. You, sir! I see you, sir! Apparently they're blind, and that's why we need to chase them, but that's kind of, you know, brings up a couple questions. I mean, apparently they're not entirely blind. Let's go get our power cell from the geologist. Okay, apparently there were only four of them. Apparently they're not blind, otherwise they wouldn't be running away in fear from my giant propeller blade, but, uh... Whatever, I guess they just hear it and are terrified of that, but uh, uh, that, if that's the case, then why aren't they running into walls constantly? Do they have sonar? I'm pretty sure there's no such thing as a type of, of, of uh, mole out there in the world that has sonar, but then again, this isn't the real world, so maybe I'm just asking too many questions. Anyway, chasing down a one-eyed flying, what, it's like a one-eyed, one-horned flying purple people eater here. We gotta tackle him with our zoomer. It's a lot harder than it should be. Go down, man! Seriously? Yeah! And there's like tw 30 of these jerks that you gotta chase down and crash into! Slow down! Do me a favor and keep away from those darn eco boxes! Yeah, 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 you know what? Ow! Whatever, I don't regret a thing. I, I... Daxter, seriously, shut the hell up. I know, don't hit the dark eco. Doesn't matter. I totally got that guy. That's all that matters in the long run, and that's the way out of here. I don't want to go there. We've got a whole lot of stuff to do here before we can even think about leaving. Unfortunately, a lot of that involves racing. And I'm no good at racing, so that's that's where the dilemma comes in, you see. But whatever. I shall remain strong and valiant. I uh, okay. And tally ho! One ring down, a bunch to go. Yes! We have to go through all these magical pink portals. It's not explained what they are, why they're here, or why we're going through them, and why getting, why going through all of them gets to power cell, but, uh, whatever. Either way, there's some on timer. If you take too long, they will disappear, and you have to start over completely. So it's basically, you know, just your standard ring stage type dealy bobs, and I'm dead. And apparently, as Daxter was dying himself, he decided to monologue about how terrible I am for running into so much eco. 
Shut up. Daxter. Alright, back to the poops. You know, I yell at Daxter, but evidently it appears he needs to constantly remind me not to run into deep dark eco boxes because I keep doing it over and over again. Completely unintentionally, but uh, regardless. I suppose it is necessary that he keeps reminding me. Either way. So many pink hoops and and the pinky hoop of there. There we go. Yeesh, these things are easy to zoom right past. This, the, the, the zoomer, I don't know if you can tell through just watching it, but it has very, very slippery controls. This thing ugh, turns very poorly. It's not, it's, it goes real fast, but it's really hard to control. Seriously, I missed that one too. Knock it off. Yeesh. That's just silly. Hurry up. We don't have all day to run through pink hoops. The pink hoops of... Okay, that was my face that hurt. Okay. Pink hoops of stupid. More... Oh, and that was a poor decision on my part. I was supposed to go on the bridge. That's not good. That's not good. That was Dark Eco. I'm trying. I'm trying. Give me a second. Seriously. Try again. Okay. And... Vamanos! Oh, that wasn't even the last one. Ah, dang it. Seriously, there's a reason I waited until I was 19 before I finally got my driver's license. This is not a thing I have any interest in doing. No, no, let's not fall, let's not fall, let's not fall. Oh, no. It's going to stop and I'm going to have to start all over again. Yep, okay, cut again. And boom goes the dynamite. Finally, made it back to where I was before. Finally! Seriously, that took way longer than was necessary. I am a terrible driver. Finally, okay. Now we can finally move on to other things. Like chasing giant purple people eaters. Like this fatty. Oh, I don't like this guy. Urgh, gotta get you. you know, those wings look far too small to be able to carry something of that weight. I call shenanigans out. Okay. Where'd he go? He gave me the slip. How does something that big and fat get away from me? Oh, there he is. Yeah, he almost ran right into me. That would've been great. Uh, uh, tight turning. Seriously. How does something like that move on a dime? This is getting silly. Gotcha, you fatty. Seriously. Fatty Fat Fattington just got trounced by my Zoomer. Ish. Chasing those things never gets any more fun. But whatever. It's time. Okay. Well, since he's here, I might as well chase after this one, too. Dang it. Come. Why? Aha! I saw that one coming. Going through the hoop. Get stuck. Fall down. Do something. Almost. Got it. Almost. So close. Boom! Booyah! All right. Now, we gotta get all charged up full of green eco. And we need to destroy these purple plants. However, they're a lot like fast-acting mold. The, even if there's just one left, it'll manage to grow back more. So you need to get rid of all of them in an area and to keep the uh, bizarre dark, I guess they're dark eco plants of some description, from spreading even further. This can be a little tricky at times, but eventually, with perseverance, you will prevail. Of this, I can assure you. I don't like the Precursor Basin. Have you, can you tell? Victory! Huh. And new life springs forward amongst the darkness. That's always nice. Give me that dang power cell. Seriously, the Precursor Basin makes you work for these dang things. It's such a jarring shift from the other places where- you keep on impressing me. But then maybe it's just because I've got low expectations. Okay, your moment of gloating is over. Get on with it! You know, Sage, I'm not in the mood for your crap right now. Just saying. Could, some positive words would have would have really helped perk me up from 
from that funk I was in, but you know what? No, you, you just, you had to go and make things even worse, because you're a colossal jerk! But whatever! No, let's not fall! Okay, I guess we're falling off this thing that I'm trying to climb up of. That's stupid. How are we doing with the orbs? We, we've we only gotten two. Okay. And Dark Eco! Ugh, whatever. I'm sure there's something important up here, otherwise it wouldn't be so damn hard to get over here. Yeah, there. Okay, got it. Thank you. Orbs. Need more orbs. Vitally important. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, we already have six scout flies. Well, that's nice. Okay. Ha! And I missed it completely. Gotta try again. And one for the money, two for the show, and three to make money, and here we go! Holy cow, I finally made it! Huh. Seriously, that took me like 10 minutes to get back up there. That is a very tricky jump. The worst part is I have to do that all over again in order to get another power cell up there. Now yeah, well, I might as well drag you guys along with me. But whatever, it shouldn't be as bad. Seriously. Why do they make you do such ti unbelievably tight turns? This is not the type of vehicle that's good for that. Oh hey, last scout fly. Good thing I came over here! Ugh. And luckily, we should be getting a lot closer. Yeah, okay, we're almost out of here. I can taste the freedom of the stupid precursor basin, and let's jump! Hurry, there's the next ring. More rings than us than Superman 64! It's Jack and Daxter, the precursor legacy. Seriously. Why are there two get into the ring things? It's stupid, and I don't like it, and I gotta do a jump? And there's another purple people eater. Your death shall come shortly. Best prepare yourselves. Really? Okay. Come on, Jack. I went right over that. That's not fair. I call shenanigans. Seriously? How did I fly over that? I didn't even jump. I don't know how high I would have gone if I did. That would have been awesome. There need to be more epic jump. Okay, that one was clearly angled in the direction. That didn't work. Oh, I'm not gonna get that. Uh, epic jump! Ah, okay, I made it that time. Oi! I would like to just state for the record that I do not blame Jack and Daxter in the slightest for the amount of difficulty I am having here. The game is good, and the controls, while I sometimes are a bit sl slippery, is still a very... It's still, it's still not hard to control. I'm just really, really bad at it. That's the only problem, so. Jack and Dexter, good game, terrible player. That's all. Eh. Are we almost done with hoops? I'm really getting tired of these hoops. I want to do things that have nothing to do with hoops. Up. Oh. Where's the next hoop? Where's the next hoop? Where's the next hoop? Where's the next hoop? Did I just miss something? Where was the hoop? I didn't see it anywhere. Duh. I'm taking out my frustrations with the blue hoops on this fat purple eater. Get out of here, you fatty, fatty, fat, 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 fatty, fat, 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 fatty, fat, 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 fat. I have no time for your fatty, fat, fat, fatness. Get over here so I can chop you up with my freaking rotary blades. Revenge! Not gonna lie, that actually felt a lot better than I was expecting. <laughs> Hoops must reach. Hoop must reach. Hoop. I see the hoop. There's the hoop. Must go in through. Hoop must go through. Yeah, go through the hoop. Seriously. Yeah, seriously. Okay. I don't see the hoop. Where's the hoop? What am I missing here? I genuinely don't see it. I think I figured out where I'm supposed to be going. I don't know how. Don't know why, but I think I got this now. Okay, just go a little bit faster, Jack. Just a little bit faster. Just, okay, we got this. 
We got this. We can do it. Eye of the cheetah. Four. Uh, almost there. Almost there. We can do it. Uh, finally! Man! And I can very proudly state to all those watching right now, don't worry. There won't be another hoop challenge in the game. Whew. Thank God. I, I've had enough of rings. Okay. So there's just one last thing we can do in the Precursor Basin. But the problem is, I always have a really hard time finding where it is. So I'm going to cut to where it is. See you in a moment. Ah, here it is. All right. Just like the guy in the barrel said, we have to beat the best time on this course. Last racing mission. Last racing mission. Wish me luck. Here we go. Just gotta go. Just gotta go. Gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. Ow. Gotta go faster, 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 faster. Am I even going the right way? I don't even. Come on. Go, go, Power Rangers. Do, 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 do. Keep going. Keep going. Not sure where I'm going. I just hope wherever I'm going, it's the right place. Okay, I could have used that blue eco, but whatever. Okay, come on. Ten seconds left. Am I even going the right way? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. First try! Woo! Ah, oh, man. Weird. On my practice file, the ring missions were easy, and that took me forever. And in this place, it's the exact opposite. Well, whatever. We're finally leaving this godforsaken realm. Oi. All right, let's go. Let's go talk to what's her face, the geologist, archaeologist. I don't really know what she is. Either way, we're going to go talk to her. But first, grab some blue eco to grab these orbs. And scout fly I missed. Good. Always good. Okay, I saved your precious lightning moles. Thank you for saving those moles. That's awfully good of you. Here's a power cell to help you out. Now I can get back to my research. Oy. No one said science was easy. I swear, that better have benefits in the future for us. I swear. Alright, uh, here, have 90 orbs. Give me another power cell right now. Oh, you have the orbs. Here's a power cell we agreed upon. Awesome! Okay, see? This rapid succession of getting power cells is easily making up for all of the unbelievable horrors just that just befelled me. Seriously, alright. Now, ow, I'm just gonna go talk to that gambler guy, see what, he's, what his dilly dilly is. Oh, great moves, kid. I knew that time record would fall. Now here's your power cell, and I can go collect my big payoff. Thrace! Trace power cells as Daxter does the jig of a thousand otzels. Very good. Here, give me more. <laughs> oh, yeah. These orbs will help me win my way back out of this barrel. Here's the power cell I promised. The sense of fulfillment d dwelling deep within me is overwhelming, I must tell you guys. All right. And we've got another one. Here, have your 90 orbs. Oh, wonderful. You brought me the precursor orbs. All right, I'll fix the bridge. But don't ask me to get involved with that creature again. I had absolutely no plan to, you big loser. Yeesh. I had a, not even this guy, not even this guy's overwhelming melodrama is enough to get me down. Also, why did I just get a power cell? That was never, that was never part of the deal. He said if I gave him 90 orbs, he would fix the bridge. He never said anything about a power cell. Whatever. Either way, let us cross this bridge. Wait, wait, before I properly do that, I must check to be on the safe side. The precursor basis, everything there. All right. Which means all the loose ends have been tied up. Grab all as many orbs as I can. We're going to need plenty more if we're going to get those power cells from the Oracle. Now, if I can just remember correctly, we actually have enough power cells to go over, fix that machine, lift that rock, and move on, but it wouldn't really be much of a playthrough if I skipped almost everything in this game. Now, would it? No, it would not be whatsoever. 
So, I'm going to free this power, this scout fly, I completely forgot what it was called. And go over here and I do believe, yep, this is the boggy swamp. Boggy! Props if you got that reference. Anyway, in this part, we did quite a fair amount and proved how much of a terrible driver I really am. And in this part, we will delve deep within the boggy swamp and see what the deal is in there. I'll see you guys then.